Moving on to our next story now, a European on the moon. Well, the lunar aspiration could soon become a reality, courtesy of the Americans. Europe is planning on playing a key role in NASA's Orion spacecraft program. This will give European astronauts a chance to walk on the moon for the first time in years. This comes while U.S.'s Artemis program aims to return humans to the moon after the 1972 Apollo mission. The European Space Agency and aerospace giant Airbus plan to uh, provide the vital service modules for NASA's Orion spacecraft. NASA has guaranteed the nation with three seats on the mission's flight. Now, the mission is scheduled for 2027, although officials are trying to reschedule earlier spots. I'm uh, an active astronaut in the European Astronaut Corps, so uh, I, I absolutely love to fly to the moon, especially you know, as a geophysicist, I, I, I have a, a great interest in that. Um, but uh, of course, there's a lot of us, so I can't know whether it's going to be me or one of my colleagues. Europe's golden ticket to the moon plays a critical role for the mission too. The European service modules are critical to power the spacecraft. They will provide electricity from solar panels and other vital supplies such as water and oxygen. The modules will enable maneuvering capabilities and the spacecraft will be able to carry additional cargo. The over 2 billion euro NASA project is a follow-up of the first Artemis mission conducted in December and returned safely after a 25-day journey around the moon. An Artemis II mission is scheduled for 2024, which will orbit but not land on the moon. The Artemis III mission, set for 2025, will place the spacecraft on the south pole of the moon. Scientists hope to find water in the form of ice on the moon during this mission. The U.S. is also planning to send a woman and a person of color to the moon for the first time. We can find out many things. The moon is an open history book. Uh, from the moon we can learn how Earth was actually formed and how it came to existence. There's evidence on the moon that is not present on Earth anymore. The mission also wants to find water on the moon, which is crucial for further exploration. The European Space Agency says that the moon has resources in the form of ice, which can be used for making fuel. We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.